Harry, our hero um, of the story, has over leveraged himself and uh, goes bust due to the uh, crashing of the banks. Um, and as a consequence, he is forced to reunite with his brother, who is a wayward creature. He calls Spiros, he calls him in and says, this and this and that, that's the situation. We need to, to sell the three brothers because I need some cash and I need to just get by temporarily. And Spiros thinks about it and he says, no, we can't do that. Their only asset is a fish and chip shop, which the three children didn't know existed. So they pack off and move to the fish and chip shop. Um, and he also meets Sophie, who is uh, part of the accounting firm, um, who is advising him on his business deals. Um, Sophie sort of helps him along the way. It all seems to be going well for, for getting, getting the house back. So in the end, he chooses um, what happens in the end? <laughs> then the family have to make their mind up between riches and real happiness. I would say it's a story of family coming together. It's quite nice. Um, and learning to appreciate what they have rather than what they used to have. And it's a story of them rediscovering themselves, their relationship and their identities.